children of the atom. Men and women granted power beyond measure. Mankind, not understanding these gifts of evolution, have chosen to meet them with persecution and death. There are those mutants that agree with the humans that this world is too small for both species, and that one shall, by necessity, be forever stricken from the face of the Earth. I believe in an alternative, a world wherein man and mutant coexist in peace. They're providing a much needed balance to an all too fragile world. To that end, I have assembled those men and women willing to fight for that peace, to defend the world that fears and hates them. To that end, I, Professor Charles Xavier, assembled the X-Men. I will go to any lengths to destroy your kind. Your mutant gifts will be used to bring your kind to its knees. Forge has made a weapon like this in the past, has he not? He has. I was the first victim. But those secrets were ever turned against us. Your extinction is now, mutant. Be careful, my children. And good luck. We believe the first step began with the retrieval of the Bastion unit. The prime unit sentinels that were behind the events known as Zero Tolerance were adrift after the defeat of their leader Bastion. The prime sentinels' ability to morph into normal looking men and women allowed them to infiltrate the facility that Bastion was being held in and retrieve him. unit retrieved, it wasn't long before the Prime Sentinels returned to their primary function, the systematic eradication of all mutant life on Earth. Prior defeat at the hands of the X-Men no doubt dictated a radically different strategy from those employed in Zero Tolerance. Thus, very unusual alliances were formed. I will assume that your presence here indicates that we have an agreement. Let's get on with this. Just being in your presence disgusts me. These defensive positions are months old, which means they are worth next to nothing now. We're not so disgusting that you won't take our money, eh, Muty? So an arrangement was made. The exact details were unclear, but the one thing that was certain was that none of this would fare well for those of us bearing an X. However, if there is one thing that the X-Men can be counted on to handle, it is adversity. Yeah. 
Cannon primed. You must be a fool to fight me. Plasma Quill charged. Cannon primed. <laughs> Ooh, I'll turn you into Schnitzel. Plasma Quill charged. Excellent team. You are definitely improving in your group maneuvers. Communication, improvisation, anticipation, and trust. Well done, X-Men. Storm, Wolverine, Phoenix, Rogue. You are all just in time. For this next exercise, we will break you up into pairs. The idea of this exercise is to combat an opponent that places you at somewhat of a disadvantage. To claim victory, you will have to improvise, adapt, and eventually overcome. Now, the fun begins. Cannon primed. Losing's not my style. Now, the fun begins. I promise you, this is gonna hurt a lot. for Gambit. Losing's not my style. Think you good enough to take on Gambit? You must enjoy playing with fire.
Your mind is weak. Losing's not my style. You, this is gonna hurt a lot. You're gonna scream for me. Six reasons for you to walk away. I promise you, this is gonna hurt a lot. You must be a fool to fight me. reasons for you to walk away. I promise you, this is gonna hurt a lot. Here comes the beating of your life! Some.
six reasons for you to walk away. Forge, I'll need you to reconnoiter the rear grounds. The Brotherhood's attack seems too focused, almost like a distraction. Investigate and report back to me. Understood, Charles. Cannon primed. to create any technological device his imagination can conceive of. We are going to create wonderful things together, you and I. The X-Men are sure to mount some form of rescue attempt. Activate the mutagenic displacement field to create false readings of Forge's energy signature. Send them chasing the Brotherhood until we're better prepared for them. And deploy a few Sentinels to each location. I want to assess the X-Men's current fighting strength. Global tracking network. Online mutagenic signatures. Brotherhood located. As you can see, whoever abducted Forge knows our technology and methods. The presence of the Brotherhood would indicate that this is Magneto's doing, which fits. Magneto knows us well enough to hamper our pursuit. Therefore, we will need more than one strike team to check each of the signals indicating Forge's presence. Some of you are injured. You will need to stay behind. That will leave only a handful of you for each strike team. Time is of the essence. Forge knows secrets, far too many for us to find him at our leisure. If those secrets were ever turned against us... Be careful, my children, and good luck. 